So we have epithelium on the surface. We have bone at the most deepest border here. So we're aiming for the connective tissue between the two layers. So your first incision in the palate is actually perpendicular you know, to the tissue and you're going to end up perpendicular to the bone. Make that second incision directly underneath the epithelium. But if we did that here, then all of a sudden we're coming out the other end. Go right underneath the surface layer. The beauty of it is the epithelium it is a little bit harder to, oh, to incise through, so you can kind of go by a little tactile sense. If I bury this all the way to there, you know, that's a nine millimeter connective tissue graft, which is more than adequate. Your third incision is really not an incision at all. We'll actually, we'll actually blunt dissect the connective tissue right off the bone. With that, I'll use this number one Woodson, whatever your favorite instrument is. I'll, I'll take a smaller one and just start elevating it off of the bone first, just to kind of get it started. After you get it started here, getting the connective tissue off of the bone, then I'll go to a, a bigger uh, periosteal elevator. This is a Pritchard, and this allows us to follow up the, the bone